attack. Second, the attempted bombing of an airline, of, of, of an aircraft by a Nigerian Abdul Mutalab. Now we have the problem of WikiLeaks. Is the United States getting more vulnerable by the day? Classified information, documents being released in their millions to the narrative of the people of the world. I'll tell you, this is the way I'm going to uh, answer that. I uh, will, in fact, uh, leave with you a copy of the November 28th statement by the White House uh, on WikiLeaks um, issue, and uh, that will uh, represent uh, the uh, official statement. There have been other statements by the U.S. government on WikiLeaks. I will leave you uh, a copy of, uh, of that that uh, sort of states uh, our condemnation of the um, release of uh, classified uh, information. Beyond that, uh, the general question of security of the United States, uh, we uh, understand the need to be vigilant, WikiLeaks or no WikiLeaks, uh, in uh, the uh, efforts against uh, extremism, against uh, terrorism, against those who uh, seek to destabilize uh, the international community. Uh, and so uh, that's, uh, um, that remains our, uh, our objective, our commitment in partnership with uh, Nigeria and countries around the world in general. Now, finally, Your Excellency, any word of encouragement for Nigeria and Nigerians as we await 2011 general elections? You want to look into that camera and give a word of encouragement to us? People of Nigeria, we wish you well in your efforts to continue to develop a strong democratic system. We're with you, and we want to do everything we can without interfering in your efforts to develop, continue to develop that uh, democratic system. We understand the importance of the 2011 elections, their importance as a, uh, as a milestone, a key milestone in the democratic evolution of uh, this wonderful country. Again, we wish you well and want to do everything we can to be supportive as is appropriate for a, uh, a partner in the international community. Thank you. Yes, that will be all on the program today. Time is really not on our side. We want to thank His Excellency, the Consul General of the United States to Nigeria, Mr. Joseph D. Stafford, who has been our guest on the program today. It is indeed our greatest pleasure to have you in the studio, Mr. Stafford. We thank you so much for sparing time to be here with us. And I convey this appreciation of the board management and the entire staff of this television station to you for making it. You're welcome. It's, the pleasure has been mine. <laughs> she? Thank you. Well, thank you for coming. Thank you. And viewers, um, we do hope that you had a wonderful time on the hot seat today. Next week is another date. So we'll see you then. God willing. Bye for now.